Come on in. Come here. <clears throat> For the opening and stuff, we're gonna have this music. <laughs> hey, my name is Adam Cowart. I'm the creator and star of the Itty Bitty Bob series on YouTube. I love movies about very tiny people. Tom Thumb, The Borrowers, The Secret World of Arietti. I've always loved adventure. I've always loved action. Tomb Raider, Indiana Jones. Every one of my movies says an Itty Bitty Bob adventure. I got into the Southeastern filmmakers with my good buddy Kenny Perkins. He loves to make movies and I thought I'll come check it out. That sounds fun. And I fell in love with it. First time I came to a meeting, the challenge was slow motion and I made a little movie in my back yard. I've always loved the idea of green screen. I wrote a story, made puppets, taught myself how to do a lot of things. And when you put it all together, it is this little story. And the whole Itty Bitty Bob series has been a, a wonderful journey. It's become its own thing. The glamorous behind the scenes of Itty Bitty Bob. We got dollar store rope. That's all you need. You just need a green screen and a dream and it's gonna happen. <laughs> to get it as flat and uniform as possible, I have this brick on this side and then one for the other. When I'm on the green screen from the front angle, you'll see my head, my feet, and everything else. This is the camera that I've used to make all of my films. It's the DJI Pocket 2. I think it was $375. It has a touch screen, controls for the camera, a built-in gimbal stabilizer. So you turn it on and it looks at you and nods and there you go. And you can flip it around, and then you're ready to film, and there we are. So this is the Itty Bitty Bob costume. It is a tunic, which is more fun to call a dress, which some people do. The tunic itself was made by my mom's friend Marilyn. She worked on it for probably six, seven hours, so it's one of a kind, and this comes from Nepal. My dad got this for me at a flea market. The bag <clears throat> is a World War I style medic bag. This has been a really useful addition to the character because it's extremely convenient. Anything I need magically comes out of the bag. All right, ta-da! So I want to get some shots of me walking through. I have this video that's like mountains of Nepal. So I'm gonna have to pretend like this is really hard to do, which it would be. <laughs> I do a lot of a lot of fourth wall breaks as well, so I might do one here. My advice to anyone just starting out is when it comes to making a film, the most important thing is the story. After that, everything else is second. The how the lighting looks, how the sound is, all things are important, but the most important is the story. And if you have a story to tell, just tell it and see what happens. Don't let anything stop you from beginning. I'm a high school teacher who bought a camera and I went out in the backyard with an idea and here I am two years later. The Halloween Spooktacular has been my favorite. It was the first time that I made these full miniature sets. It was my first time working with multiple actors. It had just the most editing behind it, removing the color, resizing things. Meeting that deadline was a lot of work. I was building miniature sets, I was collecting materials, I was editing. As I said, it was also the most the most rewarding because the most went into it. And the most special thing about it of all was when I showed it at the Chat Noir Theater. When I made the opening where the, the Michael Jackson music kicks in and the title comes on, I had this vision of like, everybody's gonna be like, oh yeah, I'm excited now. And that's exactly what happened. Everybody, they cheered and they hollered and they laughed at the funny parts. So that one I would say is it was just the most fun all around. If you go on YouTube and type in Itty Bitty Bob, I should be the first thing that pops up. You'll see a little picture of me in a hat and just go from there and buckle up.